as they move in behind the Metro Home Building Center starting gate. It's post time for race three. Now let's go back upstairs to Vance Cameron for the call. Third race, they're on the gate. American captain, it's Harry's turn, Silver Hill Diamond. All-terrain, Cabo Pan Lucas. Leave it with me, Charlie Drummond, CJ Bluefin outside. Third race, top of the stretch. They're approaching a start. They're up and pacing Cabo Pan Lucas, the first one away. Second is Silver Hill Diamond. Third into the turn, that's it's Harry's turn. Dropping in to be fourth is All Terrain. Away fifth, American Captain. Sixth from the outside is Charlie Drummond. Then leave it with me, and the trailer is CJ Bluefin. Cobble Pan Lucas will show the way to the quarter in line to Kenny Murphy. Second at the rail, that's Silver Hill Diamond. Away third, it's Harry's turn. Then in fourth is All Terrain, American Captain fifth. Six at the rail is Charlie Drummond. Then leave it with me, seventh. Trailing the field, C.J. Bluefin. The opening quarter's up, 29 and three. That's Cabo Pan Lucas on the lead at three eight. Tracking in the two hole is Silver Hill Diamond. Here comes All Terrain. He's first up on the outside third. It's Harry's turn. Fourth at the rail, American Captain. Now on the outside fifth. Charlie Drummond is sixth. Seventh and moving up. That is C.J. Bluefin. Now the trailer. That is Leave It With Me. They arrived at the half in 59 until Cabo Pan Lucas around the paddock turn for the second time. The leader, Silver Hill Diamond along the rail. All terrain. First up on the outside. Moving up fourth. That is American Captain. Fifth at the rail. It's Harry's turn. Now in six is C. J. Bluefin, seventh towards the inside. Charlie Drummond trailing the field. Leave it with me. They're by three quarters. Cabo Pan Lucas, the leader. All terrain, the only one that has a shot. Back into third, Silver Hill Diamond, and they're homeward bound off a of 129 and two. Three quarters. Cabo Pan Lucas, all terrain. Silver Hill Diamond, Cabo Pan Lucas. All the way for Kenny Murphy. Second, that is all terrain. Silver Hill Diamond, a distance third. The mile one, 58, two. Get a look at the replay here for race three. I mentioned in the pre-race how well these two get along. Kenny Murphy and the five, Ca Cabo Pan Lucas. He has great gate speed, and he put him right on the front here this afternoon. 29 and three, 59 and two, 129 and two, up to the three quarters. All Terrain and Brett McDonald, they came calling, and they put in a really big effort game first over bid here this afternoon, but there was no denying Cabo, Pan, Lucas, and Kenny Murphy here today. The drop in class uh, kicked home in 29 flat for a mile of 158 and two. We're looking at a 5-4-3 try here in the third at Red Shores. Driver Kenny Murphy's participating in the drive for charity this year at Red Shores, and he's teaming up with local business Hanson Electric, and their charity is the Canadian Mental Health. So another check in the bank for that great charity.
Cabo Pan Lucas in the third race winner's circle, pacing Chestnut Gelding. He's 11 by the Panda Rocha. From the Life Sign Dam, Gingerbread Square, owned by Gary Poulton and Alan Walker of Charlottetown, trained by Gary Poulton. Kenny Murphy in the driver's seat today, had him on top at every call, winning in 158 and two fives. Cabo Pan Lucas in the third. Down at trackside, the Donnie and Ann Simmons Memorial Cooler Presentation.